Hey, what's going on folks? John here. I'm just going to explain briefly about how to install your MT4 indicators. So you just need to install any MetaTrader 4 software such as FXCM. There's uh, several free ones out there. So you can go ahead and uh, open up your MT4 and go to File, Open Data Folder. Then go to MQL4 Indicators and just drag and drop or paste the two indicators in there. Then hit back, back, templates. And you're just going to paste the binary options indicator signals underscore dot underscore com dot tpl file in there and you'll be all set you can go ahead and just close that exit your mt4 software and you're going to reopen it then go to file new chart select the pair that you want to trade with so let's just say um, great british pound cad then you're going to right click on the chart, select template, select the binary options indicator signals underscore com template, and there you go. You'll be ready to go, and then you got to change it to one minute. The default is one hour, so you change it to one minute. And then what you can do is go ahead and zoom out, control minus, and draw in your support and resistance lines based on the putting here at the wick for all the major pivot points if you get it wrong just double click and drag like that zoom in and out by control plus and minus on your keyboard just like that and you go back and click your Cursor, control minus, zoom out, get your support and resistant lines drawn in like so, and you'll be good to go and you'll have a signal popping up like this. So you just glance at the chart and make your move if you determine that it is a good signal or if you should wait for a better position. So that's pretty much it, you know, just repeat the process whenever you need to uh, add a new pair. Just go to uh, File, New Chart, select the pair, right click, template, select the template, and repeat the process. And then of course, any pairs you want to remove, like USG, JPY, you probably don't want to use that the system just control W or right click and close and lastly once you got everything set up you want to just go ahead and click the chart shift and the scroll the chart to the end of the tick incoming so what that'll do is it'll keep the chart uh, in position here instead of having the chart um, having to keep on keeping up with the chart it automatically keeps up with the, keeping a the space here all right so uh, you guys can go ahead and check out the website for more information and trading tips and I'll uh, available if you guys have any questions thank you